Okay, ladies and gentlemen, in our last two projects, we found on the way on the side some contracts and blueprints, quite a lot of them, and they are all cherry picked. So these are only the good ones, in my opinion. Uh, we've got a lot of contracts here which are only for reveals so we will mostly run them with Gianna and we will get a lot of rogue markers and some uh, stack decks especially nothing special so far then I have here a lot of lock picking contracts which yield currency chests and those currency chests can cause of our trinket quickly equip it uh, turn chaos orbs into divine orbs so this is very interesting and we already have some divine orbs from this source we got here 14 which came from currency chests four dropped from uh, safes at the end of blueprints and one dropped from a mob yeah this is so very good so they uh, are runnable when you have this trinket if not it's not worth it i would say and then and i like those very much we've got a lot of engineering contracts and those i divided them into two uh, parts because these ones here are level four or level five and i can only run them with isla because Isla is a rogue which has um, level 5 engineering and, and I gave him this wonderful brute here, uh, duplicate contained basic currency and duplicate contained maps. So these eight uh, engineering contracts I will run with Isla, I will start with them and we will open of course a map chest. These are the good ones for the, for the really interesting maps. And the question marker chests, which can, which very often yield chaos orbs, so we've got a chance to get divine orbs. And I would say I will start with those and put the results in here so that we can have a look at it later. And then these engineering contracts level 1 to level 3, I can run with Vindari. And Vindari will get this perfect, nearly perfect brooch then uh, when I run those. And he has a chance to duplicate contained, uh, duplicate the contents of chests. So this is additional, yeah? duplicate contained basic currency. These are our most awakened sextants and chaos orbs. And those interesting maps like Shaper, Elder Guardian maps, Conqueror maps, uh, very interesting so this is what i planned and i think i will start with it now and here we are in a typical uh, engineering contract as you see there's a unique chest an essence chest i won't open them but here's a question marker chest we will open this and then on the way out we will open the smaller chests and see what we get i have to kill some mobs here and here we go no doubling up no interesting loot here's an ornate chest as you see in the small chest there are chaos orbs quite often and so we try to get those and we are done very quick under a minute i would say i will continue now and then show you the results yeah, a very interesting room here. This is uh, good when you are running level 4 and level 5 contracts because you often have two chests per room and in this case we've got two map chests. Whoa, looks good. And we already pick up our loot. Wow, very nice. And another nice room here, a question marker chest which we will open first. There can be uh, every loot in in the in heist can drop from these chests. Very often chaos orbs, not this time, and a map chest. Nice. Yeah, we did 23 of our engineering contracts, and these are the results. Not bad, not great. We will have a look on it, but first we gonna open this stack decks, of course. Yeah. 
Yeah, okay, we found, found two nice divination cards, a brother stash and a monochrome. Above that we found a patient card, Saint's Treasure, the Hoarder. Nothing too spectacular, I would say. Uh, we had no divine drops, because uh, these uh, divines are from the trinket and from contracts and blueprints we did before. Um, but as you see, we found in this 23 contracts 37 chaos ops. So there was a chance for divine drops, but it didn't happen. Okay, some currency, of course, and um, this currency here, the Saxons and the Orb of Unmakings came from uh, the map chests we opened and there were some okay maps in there. Uh, and we found a lot of maps, tier 14 plus, so not bad. I don't think that this uh, trinket is so good, but we will see. Um, yeah, that was it, but we aren't finished yet. We have some lockpicking contracts left and we will run them in our next project. Um, the engineering contracts, well, okay, I'm not uh, unhappy, but uh, we will find better things, I hope, in our next project. See you then. Bye-bye.